truth about Brad Pitt and his kids. Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie's custody battle, everything we know so far. The legal war between Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie is getting uglier by the day. More than two years after the actress September 2016 divorce filing, the estranged couple are still fighting over custody of their six children. Here is everything we know so far about Brangelina's ongoing custody battle. Signed, sealed, delivered. The Oscar winners agreed on January 9, 2017, to seal all court documents in their divorce case after the Los Angeles County Department of Children and Family Services cleared pit of child abuse accusations relating to an alleged incident with son Maddox aboard a private jet. The pair's reps said in a statement to Us Weekly, the parents are committed to act as a united front to effectuate recovery and reunification. Living with Mom After nine months of living in various Malibu rentals, Jolie and her six children, Maddox, Pax, Zahara, Shiloh and twins Knox and Vivian, moved into an 11,000-square-foot mansion in the Los Feliz neighborhood of L.A. in June 2017. Pitt who was allowed supervised visitation with the kids, told the Associated Press around the same time that he spends his time keeping the ship afloat and figuring out the new configuration of our family. Summer Agreement Pitt and Jolie reached a temporary agreement on June 12, 2018, after the L.A. Superior Court determined that not having a relationship with their father would be harmful to the children. The court also said at the time that Maddox was essentially free to go with either parent because he was 17. The summer schedule split the kids' time between London, where their mother was filming Maleficent 2, and their native Los Angeles, where their father was working on Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Jolie's Child Support Request The Tomb Raider star filed a two-page brief in L.A. on August 7, 2018 that claimed Pitt has paid no meaningful child support since they separated. A source familiar with the situation countered to us, Brad has fulfilled all of his commitments under any agreements with Angelina. Hopefully both sides can come together and resolve this, and work it out for the sake of the children. Jolie's Explanation A spokesperson for Jolie said in a statement to us on August 7, 2018, that the aim of the actress court filing was to provide closure to the marriage in a way that clears a path toward the next stage of their lives and allows her and Brad to recommit as devoted co-parents to their children. Pitt responds. The Fight Club actor filed a response in L.A. on August 8, 2018, in which he called Jolie's request for more child support unnecessary and claimed it omits material information and is a thinly veiled effort to manipulate media coverage. He also alleged that he loaned $8 million to Jolie to purchase her current home, in addition to $1.3 million for the benefit of Jolie and the minor children. Furthermore, a source told us exclusively that Pitt has contributed financially to the care, welfare and expenses of their children, adding that Jolie never asked him for child support until her court filing. Jolie hits back. The girl. Interrupted Star's attorney Samantha Blade Jean released a statement to us on August 8, 2018, after Pitt's response. Angelina's filing, was both legally appropriate and factually accurate in all respects. What has been filed by Brad's side, is a blatant attempt to obfuscate the truth and distract from the fact that he has not fully met his legal obligations to support the children, the Jean claimed. She said Pitt's loan for Jolie's home is not child support and to represent it as such is misleading and inaccurate. She added, typically a father of means would pay these expenses voluntarily without the need for a request or court order. We are hopeful that this can be resolved without further delay or posturing. Another Agreement Jolie and Pitt agreed on August 22, 2018, to continue their interim custody schedule after recommendations from the custody evaluator, according to a source close to the situation legal switch. Us confirmed on August 27, 2018, that the changeling actress parted ways with her divorce attorney, Laura Wasser. Angelina has decided to change counsel to Samantha Blade Jean, as Samantha's expertise is the protection and best interest of children, Jolie's spokeswoman told us. Angelina appreciates Laura's cooperation in transitioning the case over the past several weeks. 
Quality Time A source revealed to us exclusively in mid-September 2018 that Pitt has the children every other day, more specifically, 4 hours a day on school days and 12 hours on non-school days. A second source added, Pitt is, hopeful that at the conclusion, he'll have joint custody of the children. All Brad wants is to be a present dad and co-parent with Angelina. Headed to court. A trial in the by the sea coast Irish custody battle was set for December 4, 2018, according to court documents obtained by us on November 5. Joe Lee and Pitt also extended the appointment of Judge John Alderkirk as a temporary judge through June 30, 2019. Settled, for now. Joe Lee's lawyer confirmed to us in November 2018 that the pair had agreed on a custody arrangement and would avoid trial. Brad and Angelina will have joint physical and legal custody of the children, a Pitt insider told us at the time. Over a period of the next six to eight weeks, the monitored visits will come to a conclusion. The children will immediately begin to have overnight visits with their father. The monitors will be in place for those first overnight visits and this was done at Brad's request. Brad recognizes this is going to be a change from what the norm had been and wants to make the transition as smooth as possible. Officially single Pitt and Jolie filed a judgment to be deemed legally single in April 2019, according to court documents obtained by us. While their marriage is over, the exes will continue to negotiate their divorce settlement, regarding custody and assets, per the paperwork. That same month, a source told us that the Maleficent, mistress of evil actress is always coming up with fun things to do with their six kids. Her kids are her life, the source said. Every day is a new adventure. Brad Pitt's relationship with his six kids is frequently written about in the tabloids. Much of it, however, has not been the truth. Has debunked several false stories surrounding Pitt and his children. Here are a few wrong rumors. Last month, Busted Woman's Day for wrongly contending Pitt was battling with Angelina Jolie over their 12-year-old daughter Shiloh dressing in boys' clothing. The tabloid alleged the actor was having a difficult time with his daughter's wardrobe choices. The article was based on claims from an anonymous and seemingly fictitious source, but Pitt's own spokesperson told us on the record there was zero truth to it. The movie star, who appears to be fairly liberal-leaning, doesn't have an issue with how or what Shiloh wears. Back in January, called out N.W. for making up a ridiculous report about Jolie warning Pitt not to bring Charlize Theron around their six kids. The magazine maintained that Jolie would get her lawyers involved if Theron went anywhere near her children. The article was predicated on the inaccurate notion that Pitt was dating the long-shot star, but the two have never been in a relationship. Pitt's own rep has said this on the record many times, while Theron herself confirmed in a recent interview that she's been single for several years. Simply put, Pitt was never warned not to introduce his kids to a woman he wasn't dating. Last year, Corrected in Touch when it published a wholly untrue cover story that insisted Jennifer Aniston met Brad Pitt's kids. In that work of fiction, the tabloid maintained Aniston was introduced to the actor's children as they were playing at his home where she supposedly stopped by one day. The outlet even outrageous claimed through one of its phony sources that Aniston told Pitt's kids what a pleasure it was to meet them and extended an invite to them to come over and visit her sometime. A rep for Pitt exclusively guaranteed us the entire tale was 100% false. Worse, if possible, is that the magazine photoshopped pictures to make it appear Aniston was embracing the actor's son Knox. Days after that manufactured report, Woman's Day concocted yet another bogus story about how Aniston was going to bond with Pitt's kids on a family vacation to his French estate, Chateau Merville. The outlet asserted that once the actor and Jolie settled their custody battle, the trip would be the perfect place for Aniston to spend quality time with his kids and get to know them better. But as spokespersons for both Aniston and Pitt told Gossip Cop at the time, the exes never rekindled and there was no chance the actor was going to take a family trip to France with the former Friends star and his kids.